We just recently did a home remodel for a customer in Laguna and Miguel. And we did some very unique features that you don't normally see. One, on the backsplash, we were having four by 12 subway tiles in, in a bluish color. Then on the backsplash, which is very unique, we have shiplap. Now granted, there's no water in behind the sink area, so it was very appropriate. But you can see where the shiplap's been cut around the corners. And in this area, we really wanted to have a buffet. Look. So not only the shiplap, you see that there's supports, but this is all for looks. And then we also did a heated glass look, which has this built-in lights in the cabinet. The countertop, you see we did a different color here than we did for the main for the main kitchen to keep this as a separate furniture piece type of thing. As far as functionality in the kitchen, everything is full extension, dovetail, soft closed drawers. All the doors are also soft closed doors. Three. Pantry with roll-out trays, all dovetail roll-out trays, um, Lazy Susan. trays to put your area you put your trays in. Of course we did a country sink here and then this is a dishwasher that has a panel on it. So it's a completely concealed dishwasher. Okay some other features. We have trash pull out, soft clothes. Then you also have a spice pull out. For the countertops both countertops are quartz. You can see on the main part of the kitchen, we have a white marbly look, and then on the buffet, we have a dark black look. In addition to the kitchen, we also did their entertainment center, where we did some open cabinets so they can have their, their, their DVRs, etc. And then over here, this used to be a wet bar, we capped off the, the wet bar and made into a dry bar. And also, roll out trays so they can put some of their VCRs and DVDs, etc. Hi, I'm Mary and this is Lucy. And I went to Mark and um, told him about what I wanted. I wanted a kind of an open farmhouse plan um, that used the space the same way. I didn't knock down any walls, but I wanted it to be more efficient and more beautiful. Um, he sat down on the computer and put together a plan that made it start forming into a reality. And um, I had specific materials that I wanted to use. Like example is this shiplap. I wanted a wood shiplap backsplash. And um, he discouraged me initially because it was wood and it wasn't um, recommended for areas where there could be moisture. But um, we worked it out because we realized that was going to be far enough from the sink that it wasn't going to be an issue. And once he realized that, he worked really hard to try to find out how to put this shiplap in because he hadn't done it yet before. So he worked with vendors and got recommendations and he, his, um, his laborer, Daniel, uh, turned out he had done it before and he could do it and he did do it. And um, to me, that's one of the focal points of my kitchen. The workmanship was so great and um, I was so excited that Mark tried so hard to make my insistence a reality. Couldn't be happier with my little hutch look of this. Um, my dishwasher is hidden. I love my hidden dishwasher. It looks like a cabinet. So overall, I can't be happier. I, people are asking me, you know, who, who did your kitchen? And the design was mine, uh, but I had a partner, and his name was Mark Anderson. Yeah. <laughs> Anderson's Floors, Kitchens, and Baths, we're very much into the quality of our customer service. At Anderson's, you dream it and we will build it. We hope to see you soon at our showroom. See you soon. See you soon.